PRPS2. Teaching physical education is crucial for promoting physical fitness, developing motor skills, instilling healthy habits, enhancing mental well-being, and fostering teamwork and sportsmanship among students. Here are some common tips in teaching physical education. First, demonstrate clear objectives, meaning to say, clearly outline lesson goals and expectations to guide students' on learning. For example, in basketball lessons, specify that students will learn dribbling techniques. Second, utilize differentiation. This too. means you have have to adopt teaching methods to cater to diverse students' abilities. For example, in a running activity, provide varying distances for students to challenge themselves at their own pace. Third, provide constructive feedback. You have to offer specific feedback to help students improve. For example, during exercise, correct students' posture, and explain the benefits of proper form. Fourth, encourage positive reinforcement. It is when you acknowledge students' efforts and DRPS achievements to boost two. their motivation. For example, in a fitness assessment, praise students who show improvement in their endurance or strength. And fifth, promote collaboration. You have to foster teamwork and communication skills through group activities. For example, in a team sports like volleyball, emphasize the importance of coordination and support among players. By incorporating these principles of teaching into physical education lessons, educators can create a supportive and engaging environment that enhances students' learning experiences, DRPS develop essential two. skills, confidence, a lifelong love of movement, and overall well-being. Well I am Arjan Amuyan. And I am Queenie T. Moralde, your, your MATP Sports, Sports enthusiast. enthusiast from Graduate Studies of Sultan Kudarat State University.